6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top Allumage P4. Alexandra, you've been working on these mega launches for years. Yes. <laughs> yes. How does it feel? You're 15. It's very exciting and, and, and moving at the same time. Uh -huh. it's, uh, really, it's a big rebirth. You, apart from the first one, you have always been there. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes, from the from the second flight. Mm -hmm. So uh, you can you can admire uh, the liftoff on the launch track acceleration mm -hmm. on the first stage mm -hmm. P80 with an average thrust of two, 230 tons for a launch of total mass roughly twice less. This is what gives Vegas this particular feeling of acceleration. Very impressive, uh, Beatrice. I mean, you are used to seeing these takeoffs. It's, it's something else, isn't it? I was used to, to see those takeoffs, but always inside the Jupiter, so never outside. So, but it's really very impressive to see any anyway in the screen. So, uh, Alexandra, uh, take us through uh, a lot of uh, a lot of uh, we were just listening to the DDO announcing a lot of milestones taking place in very quick succession. Please take us through it. Yes, now it's the tail off of the first stage. It's confirmed by the DDO. And, uh, and now the separation of the first stage is confirmed. So approximately the ignition of the second one, named 0.23, it is confirmed now. And uh, the information from the launcher, we can still see the, the, the sky. It's an amazing sky we have tonight. We're very, very lucky. Uh, the information from our launch is being picked up by the first ground station along its path, as we were saying earlier, Beatrice, uh, the station of Gallio in Kourou. Uh, in mission control, uh, of course, everyone is uh, following uh, what, is, what is happening very, very closely. And you can follow on your screen here to the right. Uh, you can follow the altitude, distance, and uh, speed of our launcher, its trajectory on uh, that uh, yellow line to the right of your screen. Nominal. So everything nominal, as uh, they're telling us, in mission control.